and Calcott gets a quick play of the ball in which allows Brandon Moore to move the ball to Murray. Murray tries to barge his way over the Bradford line, but that's good Bradford Bulls defence once again. They're on the last tackle here. Halifax moving out wide with Jufre. Short ball. Halifax have crossed the line and they'll open the score in here against the Bradford Bulls. The ball there, Joe Burton. Looked like there might have been a bit of accidental contact. Halifax looked to go back to back and get the second try with Jacob Fairbank. And they will cross the line here. There's boos and jeers. A controversial predictor on again. 84% this time for Joe Keyes. Just to the left-hand side of the post. Keyes makes no mistake. Halifax keeping the ball going here with Kyle Wood to Keyes. Keyes through a gap. Keyes, he's got McComb on the outside. Keyes kicks towards himself. Burton's missed it, McCoon picks it up and he'll score the easiest try and that's a cruel blow. A Sixers at 100% here for Joe Keyes. Keyes between the posts here and that will do us half time. It's exploded into life, it goes back to Keyes, out wide to Woodburn Hall. Hall goes past Kia to Worthington, in goal area. Ball's being grounded in the goal, in goal, try. And a lot of dark days to come before the light starts to shine on the club. Keyes has the extra two. He's brought down two metres out from the Halifax line. Kieran Gill pinches one out of dummy half. Ball's grounded. Fight back here for the Bradford Bulls. Kieran Gill, try number 16 of the season. The Bulls supporters on the Western Terrace jump for joy. Is that the moment the Bulls say him again? Can Patton had a crucial two points? Yes, he can. It's Bradford.